afternoon and good evening guys rain sound here with you and i welcome you back for more cyberpunk 2077 so i hope that um you guys are enjoying the series we are here with the part number two with my ending of cyberpunk and of course we're gonna hit it later with the phantom liberty so thank you so much for tuning in and we're just gonna go hit it right away so we're left in this side of the episode and we are gonna keep continuing fucking elevators are still jammed gotta jump that's a long way down gotta jump precisely why i told you to bring the antigraphs So I hope you are enjoying the series, I want to make it more longer in just one video with everything included but I think that I cannot like just yet edit the videos for too long, See you it will be a little bottom. bit too boring for you guys as well, so you know. <laughs> I'll never get tired of this. supposed to happen like that. I was supposed to Okay. Look who we got here. Security room. Need to find the elevator to the labs. Fastest route to Mikoshi. How do I? Oh, okay. I was like, how do I go up there again? Probably a control 
Open. Patching in alt. Let your woman out of her box. Let her show us what she's got. Hey, you've always been the one. Know that, right? I do. Just a shame you never did. Well, could have been worse. Alt's in. Think she can break through the ice? I have bypassed security. I have complete control of the building. The way to Mikoshi is clear. Elevator. Now. So it's like upside. You're making it worse for yourself. Run operations control. 2067. An Arasaka bodyguard shields the Emperor of Japan from an assassin's bullet. 2071. Arasaka security forces prevent mass riots in San Francisco, saving the city from certain ruin. 2074. Bullshit. Know that look? Got something on your mind? Ever think back about why we did it? Did what? Why we took, took on the corpse, strapped in leather, chrome, and iron. Don't know, Johnny. We were young. Hot blood in our veins, shit judgment in our heads, like all pups. We fought for beauty, not knowing what was good or true. It was only the beautiful that meant a damn thing to us. Don't let your mind wander. We'll kick around old brain cells over vodka once we're done. My treat, eh? Or people with stories of the olden days, just like my grandparents. Arasaka Netrunners have stormed the tower's systems. Stopping their advance is my priority. Continue on your way alone. I've cleared a path, but you must hurry. An elite security unit is following you. Okay. Made a run for it? Wound up turret fodder. I pressed Holy fucking Christmas. my ankle. Who is she? Heart. A woman. Oh shit. Oh my god. Seems Cunningham's made strides these last decades. Shit eaters never even stood a chance. Come on, the way down's beyond the door.
on your own now. And you must hurry. An Arasaka elite force isn't far behind. Let's move it. Okay, so close, I can almost smell the data stream. Room past the partition. We cross it and we're at the core. Can't turn back time, Johnny. Ever. But you can always start over. Son of a bitch. More than, more than you or I ever could. Best, Best there ever was. was. And, and you, you killed her. She knew the risks. Rogue had it in for you. Finally got what she wanted. You're talking tribe. I killed the old cunt. Don't, Don't know shit, shit, Smasher. She finished things off on her own terms. Something you'll never get.
not here? Am I still slow because of the stuff that I just picked? Yeah, man. You're all right. Good luck, Silverman. The access point lies before you. Link to it and serve yourself. You can be on the other side.
Once out of nature, I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing. But such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make, of hammered gold and gold enameling, to keep a drowsy emperor awake, or set upon a golden bough to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium of what is past or passing or to come. Looks like I was right again. Told you I'd handle it. Good to see you too, Johnny. You see any of what went down? No, but that's probably for the best. Rogue's dead. Smasher was there. I'm sorry. Shouldn't be. Died for me. Not for you. Is my body still in one piece? Parked it in Arasaka Tower's basement, plugged it into the network. I figured as much. Your output's been torching my brain with Soul Killer for a good while now. You'll be all right. I mean, look, you made it this far. Awareness of what's happening right now? That just <laughs> raunches. Alt neatly packed me into an engram. Couldn't even tell when. Or how. So what do you think? Like being a clump of ones and zeros? At first, the phantom pain. Jesus. I felt like my whole body was on fire. I realize now, it's not pain at all, just some digital simulacrum. Guess Alt's gonna start moving this digital psyche I am back into my flesh, but... I had no idea if I'll survive, or what I'll be if I do. Soul killer, we can't feel it doing its thing. How come? Should be pissing our panties in pain right now. Digital analgesia. Or data streams. Certain sensation inputs can be blocked, blah blah, yada yada. Alt, make you suffer through an exhaustive lecture? Imparted it instantly. Whatever. She did say she'd destroy Mikoshi. Just as you agreed. Gonna release all those poor bastards only to suck them into her own bosom. Make them part of herself. I like how I can see my own character in there now. In the perspective of Johnny Silverhand. So we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now? No. What? Alt? I made a mistake in excluding the body as a factor. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit it out! In human terms! V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. Check again. If V's engram is damaged, can't you fix her? Hardware. Therein lies the problem. The organism's neurons have been dying for a time. Any attempt at a procedure upon its brain would result in the latter's death. You're a fucking genius! Think of something! Enough! Johnny, shut up! I need to think. You're gonna be alright, Think I of said, something. Give me one fucking minute! Oh, come on. There's gotta be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V. 
Who is an intruder there? The situation is different for you. All changes were made to accommodate you. Tell your ex to kick me out of my own body? The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. I will not interfere in your personal affairs, but while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Oh no. So was it was a bad choice? Oh shh. Give us what the hell for? So you could trick me into agreeing. I'm giving you a free pass, even though you can already do what you want with my body. You're my friend, V. I'd never pull that on you. Never do you wrong. Seeing as how I'm doomed to die, you stick to the plan I gave you. I leave, you stay. Keys to my body are yours. No. It's gonna be me. You lying sack of shit. So what do I do, Walt? Simply cross the bridge. You will become a part of me. As V's body and former life are restored. You fucking kidding me? Okay, easy. I think too big a dose of Silverhand wound up in my blood. I need to chill. Just promise me one thing, asshole. You want to hear me? I don't understand. Wait a minute. It says I cannot say. What is it says cross the bridge and enter cyberspace forever. Enter the well to return to this body. Cross the bridge and enter cyberspace forever. Cross the bridge. Enter the well. What is the well? Wait, 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 let's, let's, let's go a little bit. This is the bridge, so that was the choice that I want, right? I mean, that's the one that I want. Well, what is the well? The well. I don't see. Oh. I see. I mean, sorry guys, but V is V, and Johnny Silverhand had his time and his legend. Let's go. So regardless of our choices, happen with Phantom Liberty. Like does it have an impact? What is going on? Give me answers now.
what the hell just happened? What the hell just happened? out of your sets I can turn to face the sky today and today only you might catch a glimpse of the crystal palace that big ass space station in which you mere mortals will never set foot now they say the crystal palace has the most expensive casinos the most beautiful women and some damn breathtaking what is, views but where, that's where, what they say about night city where are we heaven what? Earth, heaven and orbit. what's the difference to stop eating dirt, dirt sniffers, sniffers like us one thing though better find yourselves a nice high hill to go palace gates in Yep, sorry you denizens of Night City's lower reaches. Life has screwed you over yet again. What is going on? you sitting in the gutter looking up at the smog, here's someone Look you ain't hurt in a while. Johnny Silverhead! Morning, v. I trust you had a restful night. Mm-hmm. You have no new messages. You have one meeting planned today at the afterlife. Delamain has confirmed a vehicle arrival at the arranged time. I've noticed your calendar is empty for what remains of the month. Would you like me to begin planning? No, thanks. That's as it should be. Hey, you there yet? Not yet. He'll be on time, though. His people came to scan the place earlier. Check and make sure everything's clean before he arrived. <laughs> Thought we didn't notice him. And the gear? All set with the heat. Emery Bronson. What the hell is happening here, man? Oh my god, where's my stuff? My cyber word is still in. These expensive leggings. Okay, what the hell? Golden. Okay, I like that one. Thanks. Be there soon. Take my jacket. This is my new house? I mean... Damn! What... What happened? Oh my god, what the hell? What the hell really happened? Make some coffee? What do you mean? What is, what, what, what is, what is going on? Lean. So we made it to the top. Damn. Well, I don't know about you guys. I feel nice about it. I feel that is very good. Great ending. I don't know about you guys. Maybe you had a better ending. Or if you did have uh, a much great experience on your ending, let me know. I, I like I want uh, to have a question mark in here and I hope that you guys answer me on the comments 
does it have the, like an impact on the ending um with oh my god okay what the hell so i got my stuff back But it's not my stuff. Right. So does it have... My question is the, this, this one. Uh, does it have an impact between... On the ending of... Depending on what you choose on the beginning <clears throat> of the story and... Like, for example, if I chose to be a straight kid, or if I chose to be, you know, um, a corpo or something like that. It seems like I'm a corpo, so I got to end on this, on this part. So I don't know, if, if I was a straight kid, could I be in a different place? That would be the great question. Enter key A, V, okay, oh my god, what the hell? Ooh. So, oh my god, so it seems like I got a great house Good near morning, v. Hey, Del. the edge runners. Are you prepared for takeoff? Okay. Am I, am I prepared for takeoff? I mean, I think so. Uh, the afterlife. Head over there. Your wish is my command. My, don't you look tired? Did you have a difficult night? Difficult few weeks. Success weighing you down, is that it? I was under the impression you had gotten all you wanted, that you'd shown the city exactly who is top dog. Can I help? I'd very much like to help you. Mood in the city, what's it like? Arasaka's problems continue to compound. Organizational disintegration, its share prices collapsed, public mistrust is at an all-time high. I could go on. Secure Your Soul was to be a smashing success for Arasaka. It turned into a horrific curse. They lost all resources related to the program. Mm-hmm. Promised the rich immortality. Sold him on it. Actually collected engrams and knowledge bid for control for power i say and the street rumors abound that you've taken on something rather big and that one with great power and even greater funds is backing you nothing much besides arasaka is in chaos striving to restore even a semblance of order it seems you the afterlife are safe for now good to know may i ask you something v shoot you mentioned recently that only one thing matters to you. To gaze upon Night City from the very top. I hope your deep learning covered metaphor. And you're not about to tell me to exercise caution when looking out the window. Sarcasm. Funny. No. I wish to ask what will come next, once you've achieved your aim. Ask me once it's done. Once it's all over. Of course. I shall be sure to do so. And I am glad. Why is that? That I'll be able to ask. That means it'll work. You will, in fact, return. Mm-hmm. I've chosen the optimal route. We'll be arriving shortly. One last thing before I shut up as requested. Don't... of luck V. May your plans bear succulent fruit. Hey, you there. Yes, I'm talking to you. Are you getting what you want out of life? Let me guess. Food from a tube, rusty water from the tap, another murder outside your bedroom window. But what if you could leave all that behind? Far, far behind when you begin your journey to the final frontier. Send the word SPACE to 7299 
for a chance to win a one-week getaway for two at the Crystal Palace. Boss. Boss. Hey, we good? Perfect. The box is ready and wait. I don't want we were talking in the morning. Do I know you? Did you something? I am the man. My usual. Sure thing. People can tell something's up. Won't be able to keep it under wraps much longer. Won't have to. Take off today. Today? Is that a problem? No, no. Just in that case, you're gonna need something special. Rogue had this little ritual. Before any big op, she'd knock back a shot of tequila. Silverhand's preferred. Asked her once if it was for luck or whatever. You know what she said? Said it was about remembering. Said that remembering Johnny that way helped her focus on what was important. Anyways, afterlife tradition. I'm gonna mix you up one of our specials. Just tell me who we're drinking. Mix me up a silver hand. Drink into Johnny. I mean, I only know what people say about him, but Betty love what you're planning. Shit, you know, the damn moon. I know. Good luck, V. Better than ever? Ready and win. You tell everyone here about that stunt you pulled at our soccer tower? What do you think? Claire must have heard it three times already. But what you plan to do today, V? I mean, respect. Nothing else will ever come close. Take good care of yourself and good luck. Thanks. V, I've long awaited this moment to look the latest afterlife legend in the eye. I must say, I'm moved. Happy not to disappoint. Ladies first. Talk to me. Well, V, Mikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you Eddie's influence around town. But not just that. It meant positive paralysis of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up. My people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's all systems go for the up. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use that moment. Won't be disappointed. Pick the best Merc around for the job. So I've heard. But I'd like it proved to me as well. Speaking of which, nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like this. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. They'd say you're taking too big a risk. Poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. Guess that's why you hired me. <laughs> you know why I hired you? Because you'd do anything at all for even the faintest chance at survival. Even if it meant coming to within a hair's breadth of your untimely death. This time tomorrow should have the casino's client data. All of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. Good luck. Right, in position. Perfect. Almost to the second. My turn. 
Satellites are down for now. Just got the signal. Signature cloaking activated. Remember, got one shot and one shot only. Hmm, tell me something I don't know. As soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance at extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. Times when I had something to gain are long gone. Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of grim. Then again, who am I to judge? Oh my god, what the hell's going on? Are we like in super space? Okay, what the hell are we doing in here? Okay, here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out. Somebody tell me something. What is that? Oh my god. He is crazy. I'd say my be is too crazy. I cannot believe my eyes, but it was an amazing ending, man. I know there are so many different endings, but I think I hey, love hey, this ending. What's up, kid? Been a while since you came to see old Vic. I'll bet you're chums at the afterlife found you a new Major oh League Ripper. God. Them swanky downtown fuckers shooting chrome out his ass. Am I right? sometime okay next time you're in the neighborhood we'll talk about old times and i'll take a look at you make sure that the new ripper of yours didn't screw anything up see you around v hey v everyone's telling me you're a base gordo now a big shot eh <laughs> So big you can't call me once a week. Once a month, even. Don't forget where you started. Who you started with, hmm? My door's always open to you, V. There's always food on my table. Mi casa es su casa. No se te olvide. Ahí te veo, V. I was just wondering how you've been. Haven't heard from you in a while. Still living large in Night City? I don't know. All I think about is dropping everything and leaving. Yet, here I am still. 
Oh, the city's like quicksand. The more you try to get out, the more it pulls you in. Once you're up to your knees, you're never getting out. I'm like, I'm like Evelyn. Anyway, look out for yourself, okay? And call me sometime. Bye. Hello, V. How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh... I don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, uh, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well... All of us have been wondering when you're finally going to drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. This city needs more people like you. But I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Hey, V. Jefferson Perales here. You know, mayor of Night City. I'm calling about our recent program to tackle homelessness. What would you say about being the head of my security detail, huh? As you know, the number of people I can trust are few and far between. Next week, we're going to be raising the city's taxes, so things might get a little hairy. Come by, we'll hammer out a good deal for you. I'm no any pincher when it comes to safety. All right, well, we'll be in touch, V. Hey, V. Listen, I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot. I know, I know the reading's not as strong without you here, but... We haven't seen each other for so long, and I... Well, one thing led to another. Know what I drew? Strength, the Emperor, and the world. Babe, the world's gonna hear about you. Go and show Night City what you're made of. Thank you for tuning in guys, thank you for the support, thank you for being here and being part of this masterpiece called Cyberpunk 2077.
A big shout out to CD Projekt, they did an amazing job. Even though, even though, people thought it was gonna be a bad, bad game because of how it showed, about how it was, right? But I think they did an amazing job. So thank you guys so much for being part of this series. As always, if you do did like the video, please do like the video. Of course, share it with your friends. And as always, if you want to support my channel, keep continuing on the future um, series. Of course, you gotta see Phantom Liberty, right? But um, if you want to be part of this uh, crew, subscribe to the channel. Leave a like, leave a comment, and ring the bell for me. Thank you so much, guys. I'll let you enjoy what it is off left on, this, uh, on the credits. So, thank you so much for tuning in, and I'll see you on the next one. Have a great day, chumps. Said what you have